Hello again, everybody. It's Sam, the real estate man here. I hope you're doing well. I want to provide you with the housing market statistics and rally of North Carolina for November of 2023. If you are just joining us, then welcome. Please hit me with a follow because every month in the rally triangle surrounding area of North Carolina, I'm going to provide you with a housing market statistics. So if you own a home in this area, you might want to follow along to see where the housing market is at statistically each and every month. Let's start with the big three statistics. So new listings are up 2% in November compared to November of 2022. We got closed sales down 8% compared to November of 2022. And the median sales price overall is actually down 4.5% compared to 2022. So what has the median sales price gone down to? Well, in November of 2022, median sales prices in Raleigh, North Carolina was $420,000. And now November of 2023, $401,000. I will say overall the housing market is still strong in Raleigh, North Carolina because of the percent to list price received is still sitting at about 99%. So for every home that goes on sale or every home that's listed in the MLS is getting offers about 99% of their listing price, which shows a strong market. One interesting statistic in November is that the days on market until a sale actually went down in November. So we're starting to see homes sit on the market for a little bit longer, but interestingly in November of 2023, it's taken 25 days on the market until you receive a accepted offer. Then the three last statistics that we don't want to see in the housing market is the affordability index continuing to go down month after month. That's just how they view how affordable housing is in the area. So not as affordable every month, almost this whole year. Inventory of homes for sale is also going down. I'm sure you know there's an inventory, a housing shortage. Inventory continuing to decrease obviously is not what you want in a housing market. And then the supply of inventory has stayed the same. You want to see about a five, six month supply of inventory. Plenty of homes on the market, plenty of buyers, a lot of action, but only a 1.9 month supply, which has been low since the pandemic. And lastly, let's look at these bar graphs behind my dome here. You can see that November comparing 2022 to 2023, very similar numbers, a little bit less closed sales, but pretty much the same as far as listings goes. But as we see in 2023, the housing market for the past 12 months, new listings down 17%, closed sales down 16%. So from a housing market standpoint, you do want those numbers to be in the positive. Uh, but it's been a trying year for all of those that are paying attention to real estate this year. Luckily, it is December now, so this last month. And of course, the Fed is saying a lot of good things ahead in the housing market uh, for next year. But these are the November of 2023 housing market statistics for Raleigh, North Carolina. Please support me with a like and a follow. I appreciate it. Let me know if you have any questions and have a wonderful day. Thank you.